fruit. Uh, Luke 3.16. John answered, saying to them all, unto them all, John the Baptist, by the way, I indeed baptize you with water, but one mightier than I cometh, the latchet of whose shoes I am not worthy to unloose. I don't use the word latchet. I'm sure you know what he means. He shall baptize you with the Holy Ghost and with fire. Fire, you say. Fire Oh my goodness, there we go again with the fire and brimstone. You know what? Calm down, God. Seriously. We're doing okay. We're trying our best. You know what? We're doing a lot of charity work. When disasters happen, you know, there is good within us. You know, there is uh, uh, some good within us. Um, we are made in the image of God, whatever that means. Um, and in that, therefore, is mercy and compassion. Um, but we are also hopelessly cracked. Um, bad people do good things. You know what I mean? Um, Hitler supposedly was quite sweet to his dogs. Does that make him, in general, like a person we should go, oh, there, there's a model of human behavior? Mm, no. And you're like, come on, man, I'm not Hitler. You know what, okay, Hitler, that's hit comparing Hitler to other human beings. But let's go ahead, as Hitler is to, let's say, um... Teresa, uh, ah, Teresa, that's like St. Teresa, or Mother Teresa, that'll make you think of her, uh, as Hitler is to, let's say, Bob, sorry all the Bobs that I know, because I know a ton, don't mean you, uh, or maybe I could mean you, thusly, we are to Christ, thusly, we are to God, because you're talking about divine perfection, Perfection, the perfection of righteousness, peace, goodness, fruit, mercy, love and kindness, be mercy beyond justice, just a, a beauty that cannot be contained and can contain uh, no ugly. It is too sweet, it can contain no bitterness. It is too light, it can contain no dark. Then, yes, okay, okay then, compared to that. So why fire? That just seems heavy. Um, and indeed, I always felt like the, you know, the the, ra the fire, the raging fire, the raging forest fire, the volcano even, have always been this, like, insane, massive, and still to this day are, uncontrollable uh, symbol of kind of God's wrath and his, and his, you know, stern, rumbling displeasure. Um, got a little old Peter, like Peter O'Toole and that was in there. Um... But indeed, they are, they are there also as a baptism. We've so long seen the, the chastening hand of the Lord as a negative thing. And indeed, the chastening, the purifying fire, let us consider it like a, a volcano. Let us consider it like a, a, like a wildfire. We have them here all the time. And they will scourge the area, lay waste to lives. Man, we're, none of us are sinless, though, so like, don't obsess about it, but you know what, are you, we didn't deserve this, you know, we deserve m much worse. But that fire comes, and after that fire leaves, I've seen it happen here, and it's beautiful. The green, lush awesomeness that springs up from a fortified ground, 
rich volcanic soil, Napa Valley style, y'all, is a beautiful, lush, eternal green. It is a far more strong uh, fruit that will grow from that fire. Likewise, do not fear the chastening of the Lord. If the Lord is chastening you, my friends, he is trying to teach you. And if he's trying to teach you, then he gives a rat's ass. That's right. I said ass, Mom. Mother's Day week of all weeks. The Lord gives a rat's ass. Peace be unto you. Amen. Selah.